next time. Well, it's Christmas Day. This is my little brother Tom. A year and a bit ago, he wasn't happy with how he looked. He was overweight, pretty low in confidence, and he wanted to change that. What are your goals for this? Lose weight, get less chubby, uh, get stronger. And that led to something pretty awesome. Tom put himself through a brutal transformation. A hundred days of blood, sweat and tears later, he was in the best shape of his life. I was so proud of him, my parents were so proud of him, you guys were so proud of him. Tom's transformation is <laughs> sick, man. It was fucking awesome. Where is Tom now? The last time you guys have seen him was June 30th, 2021, 395 days ago. What has happened to him? Oh, okay, here we are. This is my little brother Tom. Do you want to say hi? How's it going, guys? Uh, yeah, I'm Tom. Why did you stop working out? My motivation to go to the gym just became lower and lower. I just enjoyed it less and less. Slowly got less and less consistent, and then eventually stopped going altogether. So he hasn't touched a weight in a year's time, and it really made me wonder, what does a whole year off the gym do to somebody? How has his physique changed? How has his strength changed? I wanted to find out. Are you happy with your body at the moment? No, definitely not. Okay, okay. So this was Tom before the transformation. He was technically overweight. He then did the transformation and boom, ended up looking like this. So what does he look like now? He still looks pretty lean. I was genuinely shocked of what I saw. This is him before, this is him after the transformation, and this is him a year after not working out. He looks so much better than I expected. I'm just sort of on dad bod right now. I wouldn't say that's dad bod. No. Next, what about Tom's weight? Before the transformation last year, he was technically overweight, weighing 86 kilograms. At the end of the transformation, he got himself down to 82 kilograms, and now... 82.5. He literally only gained half a kilo, which was so shocking, as I spoke to my mum earlier, and she said... So when he was doing his transformation, he was really good, and he didn't eat anything bad. But when he was, well, since the transformation, he's just stopped that, really. Really? He buys a lot of crisps and rubbish and junk. You'd think if Tom was one eating all this crap and two not working out, he surely would have put more weight on than this. Finally, Tom's strength. Tom's warm-up max was 50 kg on the bench at the start of the transformation. 100 days later and he hits 75 kilos. If I can get 65, I'll be happy. Well, let's find out. Yes. If I can get 65, I'll be happy. He made that look way too easy. Next, we added 75 kilos on the bar, which was his previous one rep max. Come on, man. Come on! Come on! If he gets this, this would be mad. Come on! As you can tell, I was in shock. Tom then wanted to bump the weight up even more to 80 kilograms. An all time PR list. Fingers crossed. Push it up. Just push it up. Push, 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 push,
thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed, I'd really appreciate it if you could hit the like button and maybe also consider subscribing. And lastly, if you want to get any supplements like protein powder, creatine, pre-workout, head over to my protein, which is the first link in the description. Use my code Joe at checkout, which will save you 37% off your entire order. Not only is it the cheapest way to get supplements, but it also helps me out a ton. Cheers, guys.